My name is Mila Hall. I'm honored to receive an FNR award for outstanding PhD thesis, and I'm excited to bring the knowledge from my doctorate back to my home country, Luxembourg. My PhD aimed to make psychotherapy more efficient by intensively collecting data from patients and then visualizing it for their therapists. Psychotherapies treat psychological disorders by helping patients and therapists build a shared understanding of symptoms and their interconnectedness. And these interconnections can be captured in network models. Networks are data visualizations often used in statistical research. Past network studies of depression have found strong connections between loss of interest, concentration issues, and fatigue. This made me wonder, could person-specific networks be useful for therapists to understand the uniqueness of their patients better and faster so they can provide a more effective therapy? To explore whether networks could be helpful for psychotherapy, I developed a system that asks patients daily questions via their smartphones. This data generated a unique network model for each patient, which was shared with therapists as feedback. Therapists could use this feedback to confirm their perspectives, set therapy priorities, or discuss it directly with patients. Given that my PhD was perhaps the first study to bring networks into outpatient psychotherapy, I knew that the feedback would require some adjustments. So opening a dialogue with our therapists about their user experience helped motivate them to trust the system I had built and become more open about using this type of data-driven system. Many therapists were very reluctant to use a data-driven system in practice, which really highlighted the significant gap between researchers' and practitioners' perspectives. Bridging this gap unexpectedly became a secondary focus of my PhD. My main takeaway from the study is that data-driven tools for psychotherapy can be powerful when they're built mindfully and in close collaboration with the therapists and patients that use them. What's most important, after all, is that we help patients get the support they need. And I'm looking forward to moving this important research along and potentially applying my knowledge to other fields too.